The Jim Blurton bar shoe range, due to their design, require minimal fitting. Jim Blurton's bar shoes come in a range of sizes from treble zero up to size five. Jim Blurton's range of bar shoes are designed for maximum support and ease of fit. They take the specialist bar shoe to a new dimension. Pitched nail holes help provide the angle for the nail to follow the contours of the hoof wall, making nailing on easier. Side clipped to provide the stability of the shoe on the foot. The strong clips allow for the refitting of the shoe without compromising the strength of the clips. The countersunk position for stud holes allows the stud holes to be drilled in a balanced position on the shoe and easily tapped. Safed off at the heel, saving time whilst providing an excellent fit to the foot. A rolled toe facilitates breakover, providing comfort for the horse and allowing ease of movement. A seated foot surface reduces the possibility of sole pressure and provides a cavity to secure soft packed materials. Thanks to Jim Blurton, fitting bar shoes has never been easier. Hayden Price introduces Jim Blurton's straight bar shoe. The Jim Blurton straight bar shoe provides at least 25% more surface area and support than a conventional shoe. Before shoeing the horse, it is important to assess the horse's conformation, both statically and dynamically. Following the initial assessment, an individual shoe implant should then be considered. The full range of Jim Blurton bar shoes encompasses a high quality, bespoke hand forged shoe, all within the convenience of a ready made shoe. The Jim Blurton straight bar is an ideal shoe for the treatment of horses suffering from corns, quarter cracks, along with various other hoof conditions. Jim Blurton will now demonstrate the fitting techniques for his straight bar shoe. With a shoeing plan in place, Jim begins trimming the foot, paying particular attention to the symmetry and the mediolateral balance. He uses his rasp to check the symmetry of the solar surface. Jim lightly dresses the foot forward to remove any flares, ensuring that there is no distortion to the hoof wall. Jim checks the mediolateral balance again before selecting the correct size shoe. Without the aid of radiographs, Jim uses a few general guidelines to maximise the effect of his straight bar shoe. The toe of the shoe may need to be fitted under the toe slightly. Jim uses the widest part of the foot as a general guide to indicate the center of rotation. He aligns this with the shoe and ensures that there is a minimum of 50% of the shoe behind the center line of rotation. A plumb line is taken down the lower limb through the center of the fetlock to the ground. This indicates the length required for sufficient caudal support. Looking from the solar surface, a parallel line can also be taken level with the widest part of the frog. This will confirm the support required. Jim recommends taking a good even heat before making any alterations to the straight bar shoe. He makes some minor alterations to the width before setting the clips on. He can then take the shoe to the foot for fitting. Jim checks the fit of the shoe. He eases the clips in to ensure a good clip fit. 
With the shoe fitted, Jim uses a grinder to complete the safing. Once Jim is happy with the fit, he nails the shoe on. The pitched nail holes built into the shoe makes nailing on easy and helps maintain a strong hoof capsule. With the shoe nailed on, Jim clenches up, rounds the toe and finishes the foot to the high standards you would expect from a world champion farrier. The Jim Blurton straight bar shoe provides stability to the hoof capsule whilst providing caudal support. Appropriate consideration should be made for the individual horse as to the length required whilst at the same time ensuring that both medial and lateral heels are given sufficient protection and cover.